Hello everyone, welcome to External Star Channel. My name is Marek and today I will be unboxing and reviewing this beautiful BMW 7 series uh, in size 1 to 43. And in this scale, I think it's quite small, but the very much interesting thing is that actually this car has openable hood and the trunk, which is quite unusual. So let me just directly uh, check the box. So as I mentioned, this is BMW 7, uh, 750LI, LI stands for long version, so this is the long version. It's a uh, collector's model, not a toy, so again not suitable for children under 14 and yes it was made in China. Okay, so it's actually licensed by BMW, so great, it should have all the details, there is also a logo here on the box and the manufacturer, even if it's not mentioned here, uh, my best guess is that this is Paragon models because the box looks exactly the same like for all other Paragon models. So let me just remove it out of the box. So a little bit now shake it and okay, that's it. A very nice model and uh, it's a beautiful box and actually there is a tape here and tape here. So what I'm gonna do next is that I am uh, going to gently remove this tape so that then I can actually open the box and I will do the same also on the other side. Oh, there is a crack here. So it came from China and during uh, the sending process <laughs> A crack appeared here unfortunately so yeah what can I do now there is no way how to fix it and if the crack is only on the box I'm still uh, not that disappointed if if the crack would be on the glass of the car then I would be already a little bit crazier okay so also on the other side okay S tape is gone so now I think it's only time to remove the cover and show you finally uh, the model itself. Yeah, so <laughs> wow, there is a lot of holding tape in there and actually I would need to remove all of these parts and wow, it's well protected and I think the reason why it's so protected is that really uh, you can then open those parts and every time when it's openable maybe let let me start already oh it's it seems like uh it's not really connected and as you can see i can already open and it's so delicate it's so small maybe i will just use my fingernails because i don't want to scratch it with this uh dental tool and this dental pick is actually quite scary <laughs> so, yeah I don't want to scratch anything so this time just my fingernails okay as you can see it's not one piece okay so in the front we are done now here in the back I will just do the same Okay, there's actually no no glue after I remove it. Sometimes there are some stains, glue or whatever, but here it looks like nothing remains on the paint, which is a good sign. And okay, now only the final, final tape, which is here all over the car. And how can I do that? I think the easiest thing would be here. What is actually this? Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Maybe I would just need to cut it with my scissors, okay? So um, I'm of course prepared for that and I will just cut it here and then I can remove it. Okay, now I think it's fully unboxed already and uh, what we can do is to really enjoy uh, the model and Right now I will not uh, unattach it from from that uh, stand, uh, it, it will remain there. Just to show you that there are actually two screws, so I would need to uh, 
untie them and then uh, yeah the car could be freely placed but now I want to just keep it on the stand okay so let me maybe start the review here in the front as I always do it and uh, with this front grille which is actually so detailed look at that uh, I love it I love it it's also it seems like it's perforated all the details are very beautiful also the headlamps wow the details are amazing and also the license plate it says BMW 750 Li and then uh, we have also a few other details like here this square uh, and actually maybe uh, the light on the left side is a little bit pushed inside yeah if, if you compare those two lights uh, you see that this one here is not in the right position it's a little bit backwards okay but it's just a subtle detail but maybe yeah something uh, to be mentioned here okay then when we check uh, from the side it's actually also very beautiful <laughs> oh my god it's so beautiful uh, you can see the wheels which are like almost perfect you can see also the brake discs I'm not sure about the brake calipers and unfortunately you cannot open the doors but maybe we can have a look inside so through the glass you see all the details inside there are also the seat belts uh, the gear shift all the details um, yeah the steering wheel it's quite beautiful I also quite like uh, this chrome frame around the windows that's also amazing and then when we turn it here from this side uh, it looks like almost perfect uh, there is this X drive on the on the left here uh, and there is also this 750 Li but actually the zero is somehow not complete you see 75 and this should be zero but it's somehow there is a small mistake in quality yeah quality gap here so unfortunately 750 uh, it's not really precise and here also on the license plate I see like this five and zero it's a little bit rotated to the right uh, it's like five degrees or something like that also not 100% precise and then we have the exhausts here uh, I must say they are quite fine they look okay all the chrome and so on and actually you can, you can also see that uh, the side mirrors are reflecting so that's also very nice uh, I just realized that there is also a, a glass sunroof uh, and I'm just checking if this can be somehow moved or operated it looks like yeah it looks like it can be a little bit moved I'm not sure if this is intentional and I'm also oh look at that so the reason is that it just fell off <laughs> okay so it's not there is no glue apparently it's just all right I would need to probably fix that because I think this is not intentional and maybe the glue is not that good and somehow this is falling apart okay so at least we can see the interior now you can see the steering wheel uh, the, the screen the middle console all all the details inside but unfortunately this glass needs to be somehow fixed and I would need to glue it back in okay but this can be done quite easily so it's no rocket science and uh, definitely I can I can fix this detail here so later uh, I will just play with that and uh, fix it a little bit okay so now I think the most interesting part is just coming uh, it's opening the hood and let me just do it very gently okay so it's not actually holding up I need need to have my finger there so otherwise it would fall down yeah so it would hold in this position and you can see the engine now and how this can be opened wow 
By the way, the price was like, I don't know, 40 or $50, so not that high, uh, but it's one to 43 model, so very tiny yeah, in compared to my other models. I also reviewed this one in size uh, one to 18. It, it's also a great model. So maybe now you can check also how I unbox this one in a separate video. And here is the preview of this video. Okay, and now uh, let's go back to this one. It's this BMW 7 series 1 to 43. And actually, you can also open this, this part here. Okay. Is it difficult? It's quite easy to open it. And what is in the trunk? Uh, there is actually, there's no carpeting, so it's just pure plastic and nothing else inside, but it's a very nice detail that you can actually open it. Yeah? So not so many uh, 1 to 43 models. Uh, you can open the trunk, you can open also the hood. Uh, this is something uh, exceptional. And on this one, you can also open uh, the sunroof, but it's it was not intentional, okay? But all right, so what would you say this BMW 7 1 to 43? Uh, perhaps by Paragon Models. I love it so much. It's a beautiful model. I'm so glad I have it. Also, uh, the price was not that astronomic. Like for other cars, sometimes I see like 100, even 150 uh, US dollars. This one was uh, for 40 US dollars, so something like that. Quite affordable and uh, the features are very nice. So I like the details. I'm glad I have it and uh, yeah, thank you for your time for watching this video now. I think only time uh, for the final review or fi final rating. So wait for it and thank you. Bye bye. Thanks for watching.